the best way to store spray paint because you can see all the heads and quickly grab what you want. I don't like things stuck to things deep. Because like this, this doesn't do any good to like walk up to it and then have to like move things out of the way. We're actually gonna cut this down. And then the cabinet's gonna go right there. So like pretty much everything that's stored here that you can't really see other than this is all gonna be on this rack and it's gonna be easily grabbable. Look at my boat board. Does that drive you nuts? <laughs> this is scrap. You want to drill your first pocket hole ever? Matt Cremona is about to drill his first pocket hole ever. Shelves done. Now I can go bevel these. What do you know? What do you know? Pocket hold. What do you know? Okay. Yeah, it's like we're a team or something. Yeah. Cut in the corner from the inside. My bad. Do the side first, the side over here. Smart person, you do. Oh, you're so intelligent. <laughs> Quarter up from that. <laughs> On the inside. On the inside. Uh -huh. uh, the quarter. On the inside. Do you know the trick on the sixteenths on the tapes? Or you just like double the eighths top? I always get the sixteenths mixed up, and then somebody told me if you take the eighths, like five eighths, that's ten sixteenths. Oh, yeah. It's fractions. Yeah, no, it's elementary <laughs> stuff, but it like was a game changer. I thought there was like an actual like one of those funny tape measure like, trick things. No, sorry. It's just like working with my brain trick things. And then I just learned how to um, the trick for figuring out what's half of a fraction. Double the number. Yeah. Gosh, I hate you. All your knowledge. I went to elementary school. <laughs> communication method for please pass me a screw. <laughs> wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Meh. This is upside down again. Yes, it was. 
Well, the angle was faced oh. the wrong direction. Okay. That was not, that was upside down. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but did we cut it wrong then? Oh no. I'm gonna rewatch the footage on that and see if it was in here wrong the first time. No, look, it is wrong. wrong. No, it's not. Oh, this is, <laughs> sorry. This is right. Okay. Right? Yeah, now it's right. Yeah. It was, it might have been right the first time. I'll have to rewatch the footage. <laughs> That is the right way. Okay, yes. Right? <laughs> I bet I bet you anything, you had it in there correctly, and I'm like, that stupid boy, he has it in backwards. Let me fix this. <laughs> this is so smart. The fractions. <laughs> in his head. There we go. This side's good. You know what? The like ha our, our hands are our most precious tools. I almost, like, my instinct is to use my hand as a hammer, and it's like, nah. -uh. See? Break him on the roll. Okay, now let's like, lift it up. I guess so people can see what it actually looks like. Really heavy oh, no, no. <laughs> yeah. You can just lift it up all by yourself. Make sure I'm flexing the whole thing. Show your muscles. Can you get out of there? Yep. Okay. Where you want? Uh, over there or anywhere. Yeah, and that way I can still reach these. So I'll probably raise this up just slightly yeah. to where. Let me get a can real quick. Oh, here's one. I just want to be able to set this here and then reach it. And then if I could still use that shelf or something, then that's the best use of space. Yeah? Aha! Yeah. I guess I could wait. Actually help you work and not just hang my shelf. <laughs> Remove the spacers. No, we can. <laughs> what is this? I thought we measured this. My lids are not on. Oh, okay. My lids are almost never on. Let's put it in this one. Okay. Uh -huh. So that one just came on the bottom. That's for the new can. Matt, I think you completely rocked those pocket holes. Thank you for showing me the ropes. If you'd like a free SketchUp model of the storage rack, then head over to tritontools.com.